hello there, good afternoon, it's me again. Uh, we'll try and squeeze this one in just before we finish for the day. Uh, this one here is a 2010 on the 10 plate. It's a new model, obviously. Ford Transit 350 Jumbo. Now the Jumbo, for those of you who don't know, is basically Ford's uh, version of an extra long, long wheelbase. So this is the kind of size of the, the, the big long sprinters you might see in the road, or the big uh, long Volkswagen crafters. This is uh, very comparable in size. We have owned the van from you, so it's one owner from you that was ourselves, um, out on a, a long term contract, uh, 52,000 miles, I'm sure it is, I'll clarify that in a second. Moondust Silver is the colour, it's a factory colour Moondust Silver. Now, um, another uh, nice addition to the vehicle is the fact that it also has the bigger 110 horsepower, I beg your pardon, a 115 horsepower engine, not the 100. So it's a 115 horsepower with the 6 speed box, when it goes up to 115 it then means it gets the 6 speed gearbox. In the back, as I'm sure you would expect nothing less from us here at Clarkson's, as clean as you could ever wish for, very very presentable, very very clean and uh, ready for its new life. Got the steel bulkhead up front with the timber um, uh, section at the bottom there. Got the, the, the storage area above the driver's cabin, I'll show you that in a minute. But essentially, absolutely spotlessly clean. Still under manufacturer's warranty, that'll be until sometime in 2013. And at that point, the van will also be due its first MOT, but that's not until next year. Uh, spare keys are with the van, they're not on the ring just now, but I'm sure they're not far away. And I'll just show you in the side door. I've left it running as well, so you'll be able to hear it idling as well, and I'll give it a couple of revs up and down, just so you get a, a, an overall feel for the van, or the, or the best feel that I can give you, if you pardon the phrase, uh, via, via the internet. There's the storage area up there, that flap comes open. That, that can come off, if you don't need that it can be removed, it's only held in the press studs all around it. But you've got a hinged door there, and there's a nice bit of storage up there. Steel bulkhead, moulded back as it is to allow the driver's seat to recline a wee touch. And you've got the timber section over the bulkhead there, just to keep the metal behind it nice and uh, protected. Side step, as you, as you would expect. And coming around into the cabin, it's the same story with the outside as it is in here. Very, very clean. You can see there, there's no burns, there's no stains, there's no tar spots or glue stains or, you know, ketchup stains. I mean, these vans are, people sometimes live in these cabins and sometimes they can really get in a, a hideous state. But this one has certainly enjoyed the easier life and that's immediately evident by looking around the van. Usual new model transit layout, I'm sure you've seen this before as well. Very, very handy. Bottle holders, cans, pens, phones, open storage, uh, glove box in here. Need to get that seen, it's a bit loose. Uh, a dash top storage there, um, some paper storage there with your tea table there. CD player, your ventilation controls, all very self-explanatory. Nothing quirky or oddball that you wouldn't understand even if you jumped in it for the first time. As you can hear, it's sitting ticking over. Nice, smooth, steady idle. Right, let's jump in the cabin and I'll show you inside. Right, here we are in the hot seat, as it were. Turn the engine off. You've always got your blue remote key with the, the operational buttons on it. The red light down here is because the doors are open in the van. Turn the ignition on, all the lights come on as you would expect. A couple of turns and away she goes. 53,000, I think I said 52, but it's 53,254 miles. Got that six speed gearbox that I mentioned to you earlier on. And across to the right hand side here we've got electric windows. 2008 onwards, these vans were fitted with a thing called a hill holder clutch, which automatically applies the brake in a hill start situation. Uh, very, very handy when you're out in the open road. It's also got a thing called an economy shift light that will come on and uh, change, tell you to change gear if you're driving 
uneconomically. These lights, there's a, I'll, I'll show you them just now, but I turn the ignition on, a couple of green lights will come on and they'll go off quite quickly. You see the top and bottom green lights? That's your economy shift light and your hill holder clutch. So there we go, just about finished. I'll give you one more quick whiz around the bodywork before I finish up. So just to recap, it's a 2010 on the 10 plate Ford Transit 350 Jumbo or an extra long, long wheelbase. 2.4 turbo diesel, 53,000 miles, owned by us from new. Has the bigger 115 horse engine, which means it now has the six speed box, which really does make a difference on the open road. And that door closed. And there you have it, a very, very nice clean van in all respects. Cabin, bodywork, rear load space, the plastics are all in good order. Um, very, very, very clean. These vans in this day and age are like hen's teeth, you just cannot get them. So we're quite privileged to have such a desirable big van in stock. We don't do the heavy sale here, but I wouldn't hang about too long because we know our product and we know that won't hang about too long. Happy to help you, delighted to, to deal with you if it goes that way. And uh, believe you, maybe don't do the heavy sale, but please do feel free to give us a call.